my fellow nerds and fitness nerds, nerdy fitness people. I am Pablo Gunner, and I am here to talk about nerdy things and fitness things and a combination of things that are both. So yeah, so yesterday I was late. I left the house late because I was busy, busy editing stuff and dealing with some disputes in the YouTube. Uh, not like I wasn't arguing with anybody. It was like we, we got checked for like, uh, like using the Neon Genesis Evangelion song, but it's not. It's a cover, sort of, but not exactly a cover because it's an 8-bit version. And the 8-bit version, I got permission from the guy that made it. So... Uh, I did forget to credit it in the video though, and so I think that was the problem, is that I forgot to credit the Neon Genesis as well as the guy, too. So, anyways, so I was dealing with that and then I had to edit a Nerdy Fitness vlog video. I, that was slightly redundant, I think, maybe. But anyways, so I was late because of that, and I got to work and I was like, I don't have time to do my regular workout on my Monday, which is the yoga and then the upper body, primarily upper body cardio, you know, like the punches and the kicks and stuff like that. So I was like, you know what, screw it. I've really been missing running ever since I started this. And I honestly feel like I lose more weight. I burn more calories running than I do for my cardio workouts. And it's mostly because my first cardio workout is mostly upper body cardio, it's not lower body. And that's where I need to lose it. And sometimes I don't even get to my lower body cardio because I can't work out every single day, twice a day. So because of that, it screws it up and I never get to that one when I need to really focus more on that one. So that kind of like begs the question of, well, if that needs to be the focus, then I should just like do yoga and then replace it with that, you know, and just be like, okay, I'm just going to do this instead. I'm going to do this uh, hardcore cardio workout because I, that's what I need to do is do some hardcore cardio because I'm not. And I, you know, and that's the thing is a lot of it is based off your intensity too. Like the more intense you are is the more calories you're going to burn. If you're just half-assing it, then you're not going to burn much. But if you do it to the limit, you know, or beyond, then you know you're you know you're know burning it up. So I think that's what I'm going to start doing is focusing more on that. But instead of doing that, I, I ran last night. Like I said, I've been missing it, so I ran. Also because, like, I really focus on music during my running as well as catching Pokemon. So that was fantastic because I got a couple Clefairies. I got a Jigglypuff uh, and some other Pokemon that like I just caught because I'm trying to upgrade or not upgrade but uh, evolve my other ones like Geodude and, and Nidorans and stuff like that. So, but yeah, I was really, I was pretty jacked off about Clefairy and Jigglypuff because they're just like, they're so adorable, especially Clefairy because like Clefairy's just like so pudgy and happy. I just I just love it. And for music, I was like, I want to try something different, but I haven't downloaded anything new. So I need some more suggestions for music for working out of any kind, whether it's weightlifting, running, or anything. You now, my dad's a hardcore disco guy, so I grew up listening to disco, so I like disco a lot. And I was like, I'm gonna download some disco, so I just got like the greatest hits or whatever that they have on on Apple Music. And so I listened to that. And to be honest, like, disco is super motivating for running. I don't know what it is about the song, It's Raining Men, but it really makes me want to, like, run towards, you know, a, a goal. I don't know. But it motivates me. I don't know what it is about that song. It really motivates me. So, yeah, I was like, I was hauling. Uh, I had a really good run time for my mile. I was slow after that, but then it's like once I get over that a mile and a quarter hump, then I'm done. Like that's when I start hitting my like runner's high and I'm just like good to go. I like I could just run forever after that, especially after like two miles. I'm just like coasting. It is fantastic. I love it. So 
Yeah, I just, I really miss running because I love being outside. Even though I'm a nerd, I, you know, I know that's kind of like a conflicting thing, but, or not conflicting, but slightly conflicting because you game inside, you know? But that's what the Switch is for. You can play outside now. Which I have been doing that too. I have played some Breath of the Wild. Oh, that game's so wonderful. It's so good. I just love it. So, yeah. And I also, uh, yeah, that's that's it. I don't think I played anything else. I wanted to. I tried to, but I didn't have time. But I did watch some more Flash. I did watch some more Flash, so I did that. And I've also been watching Defenders, and I'm loving Defenders. I'm like the, on the third episode of Defenders. And it's like, it's hit its stride. It's really hit its stride where everybody's, it's just funny, but it's serious. It's so good right now. Like that third episode, at the end of the third episode, boom, it just hits its stride. Like during it, but like really at the end. Let's see, what did I have? On the way to work, I just had a frozen yogurt, an organic frozen yogurt, strawberry uh, yogurt bar. It was, it was good, but I was still pretty hungry. And so after I got situated and stuff, I had a cheese stick, and then I also had these caramel things that I got from Pagosa that are heavenly. I shared them with everybody at work tonight that I was in contact with, and everyone, there was a consensus, a consensus that they're just fantastic. So anyways, yeah, it was, uh, it was pretty wonderful. It was, it was, it was a good shift. And then I also had this new thing, it's organic, I wanna say it's stuffed chicken breast and it's stuffed with uh, cheesy broccoli and rice. And it was interesting, it was kind of difficult to make because it comes with two two of them and then in a, in a container for it and you're supposed to do them separately and then like cut them into pieces and then do it for like three minutes or you can do them whole, do them both for like six, seven minutes or something. Or if you don't cut them up, I think it's six, seven minutes, but you have to do them separate. So it was interesting. It was different. Got that from Costco. And, uh, and yeah, so that was pretty good. And so I just snacked on those caramel things throughout the night too. And uh, in the morning I had like, it's kind of like a go-gurt, but it's organic and that's also from Costco it's like yo kids something and so I was like heck yeah and it's in a little tube so it's easier I can I can eat it on the run if I have to or whatever so it's so it's just easier uh, I don't even know what flavor it was but I know it was delicious I want to say it was blueberry so I think it's blueberry and strawberry are the two flavors but it was really good and that's it and I'm gonna have an apricot after this or is it a peach I think it's a peach actually a peach after this and yeah, so yeah, it was, it was a fun night, it was fantastic. Oh, I did some shooting practice this morning. That was freaking cool. I wish I would have done more though, but I don't want to stay super late. That's the thing is it's like, you know, I get out a little like an hour late, you know, and then it takes time to get over there and to get everything. And then you have to clean your gun afterwards. So, but that's, that's just part of it. You know, so, but yeah, it's, it's, it was fun. So yeah, uh, yeah, good stuff. So anyways, uh, that's it for me for now. Uh, it's gone on long enough. So make sure to stay fit, stay healthy, stay nerdy.